All right, quick, quick video. These guys just came in. Let's take a look at them and see how we did here. All right. Here we go. So, oh, look at that. They're thicker. Huh. So, let me show you what the samples look like. There is good news, mostly good news, and some, yeah, not, some not such okay news. Uh, these are the production ones, the ones that I got. They are smaller than the original ones, which is good, because then they're gonna fit better on that box that I did that video, right? Also, the good thing is that they are thicker. Look at that as opposed to these guys. These guys are really thin and you can like bend them and stuff, right? So that means they could carry way more current. These ones I tested them, uh, continuous 200 amps and they didn't even get it warm. So that means these could easily carry probably 400 amp continuous, right? Uh, which is more I think that you want. I mean, it's, it's for eight cells. So yeah, they have the ability to push like the, over a thousand amps or whatever and they probably start heating up here these guys can probably yeah handle maybe 500 amp continuous without any heat so those that's all good stuff what is the bad stuff well the bad stuff is that since they are thicker and because of that video if you want to put a pack together like the one i show on that video then you have to cut it in the middle, right? Because I uh, I only ordered this one size. I didn't order. Um, maybe in the future I'll order some that are custom made, the right size, so you don't have to cut them. But as of right now, everybody that's ordered these, that then you don't have to cut them. And since they are thicker, it might be harder. But here's the good news: it is possible to do it. I already did it, and now I did was use this guy right here. Yeah. I did it. It's possible to do it. Uh, you just have to use a little bit of muscle, cut it, then cut the corners. And now that uh, that's out of the way, that means that you will be able to build these. And let's change, uh, let me show you how to change, uh, how to build this pack, right? So I'm just gonna change a pack that I already built with these. And I'm gonna finish it with these ones right here. And uh, these all start shipping today. They arrive here. Uh, it was an estimated start ship date of like at the end of the month, but they're here early, so we'll start shipping them. So if you haven't ordered some of those, there, yeah, there's plenty available so, for your thing. So let's let's do that right now. plates it's all put together now i've wired it again on my 2000 watt inverter batteries are fully charged well no they're not they're like nominal 13 volts i am gonna uh start up this guy there we go 40 amps there we go 85 amps there we go, 130 amps. So at 130 amps, let's see how hot those things get at 130 amps. <laughs>
All right, so as you guys can see, that was a 12 minute test at 130 amps and these plates did not get even, you know, they, they didn't even visibly get warmer on the thermal camera, right? So they were maybe one or two degrees above ambient. So yeah, these definitely will be able to do 500 amp continuous, probably a thousand, you know, bursts or whatever. So they are within the specs of these cells. You can totally use them for your builds for audio, you know, competition audio or starting some diesel rig or some big car or any application where you need, you know, you know, a thousand amps or 500 amp continuous or whatever. Of course, you'll have to build your battery you know, the right size that can, you know, that you won't be hurting the batteries too much. And you will have to obviously wire uh, correctly, right? Use enough cable so that it can, you know, withstand or support the amount of current that you're gonna be doing. Um, other than that, these are available. You can order them at kit.com forward slash Jehu. And that's it. If you need them, go get them. Uh, oh, one last time for, for all of you guys out there that suggested that putting cardboard in between here was a bad idea to use cardboard with insulator. I'm just going to leave this cardboard wrap cell right here. And I'm just not going to mention them for like, I don't know, 25 years, quarter of a century. Uh, cell manufacturers use cardboard as insulators. I'm not going to mention that. Anyways, go ahead and leave the comments down below. Thank you for watching this video. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. All right. One last thing before I go. I realize it's been a while since I shared my life outside of my little workshop here, messing around with batteries. And I used to do this a lot more often back in the day, but I haven't in a while. And I just want to give you guys a heads up that it's coming. I happen to be one of these people that carry a camera everywhere I go and I still record everything. I just haven't been packaging all this video into nice little 10 minute videos and uploading them, right? So moving forward, I do want to start sharing more of my life with you guys again. Uh, and I realize that not everyone watching my videos currently is interested in that sort of stuff, but I'll promise you that I will try and be creative and showing you other parts of my life in a way that you will find them interesting. Like for example, recently we had a chance to take our Tesla down to LA and watch a premiere. You know, we were over elbows with a few celebrities and we got to see a movie before it came out to the general public. It was a nice little experience. Uh, we were happy to do it and it didn't cost us anything. Uh, and it was pretty cool. So we get to walk the carpet. <laughs> We're on carpet. No pictures. Coming up, I have a video where I get a skateboard from a uh, company that has reached out to me and I'm gonna do a review of the skateboard which will include me taking it apart and showing you the insides and what kind of batteries it's got inside and maybe even comparing it you know to my DIY builds that I have so so that's coming up if that interests you then you know keep your eye out for that one video all right with that again thank you for watching all my videos thank you for your support we'll see you guys in the next one bye